hello and welcome to my channel today we are exploring uh, brussels so we are here uh, at the festival it is called blue month of eight let's see it's are very beautiful around here it is a growth mark brussels it used to be a main market area yeah. These buildings are historical place like now everything is new but it used to be a main market area before in all the ages so here it is a Roman tapet it's called flower carpet It is old building. <laughs> It is a historical place actually. So in this uh, flower carpet you can see they have created a different signs. Uh, one, of, <laughs> one of them is like a flander flag. So I will show you around if I can find it. But it is well designed. Just walking along, it is a very big flower carpet. So there is a gallery if you want to take a professional picture. So you can go to the gallery from the above, you can see properly. But there is a ticket, I think it is a 7 euro, you have to pay for that. But uh, you can capture everything very well. buildings Yellow sign in the middle, of, uh, which is like a dragon. It is a flag of Flanders. today because it is a national holiday in Belgium today so as I said it is a historical uh, market it used to be a historical market but now has the time change so now we have a new market but it used to be a I forgot to mention you that uh, this 
rubber carpet. They organize it uh, after every two years. But it is started in 1917, if I am not wrong. So now we are going to towards uh, Manekin Piss. Towards Manekin Piss, which is a, a landmark in Brussels. So just look around. This is the streets of Brussels, full of people. So full with the pupils. So walking toward Manekin Piss. By this corner I have seen there is a flower gate so it is front of the hotel and the pupils are taking picture it is beautiful our uh, next destination which is we are going to see and can be a landmark uh, that place is not very far from uh, Grotmar it is like just 300 meter away Quite busy down here. So you can find any kind of shops here: food shops, ice creams, and this is souvenir shops on my left hand side. If you can see. So I think finally we are here near the landmark which is called Mannequin Beach. So it's not very rushy here. Those are trying to get the photograph. It's like very small. I thought it, must, it will be a bigger one, but this statue is very small. This one is a copy because original one kept in the museum because it has been stolen many times. So this one is the copy. It's pretty small. So just look in the corner how busy it is. See around here in the corner, but you can see there is a artwork on the buildings as well. On this building they have uh, put the art of cycles. Look at the design. Away from this corner. We are going towards car now. So this is it basically. But I will see if I can capture anything interesting on my way back to car. Exactly. 
So if I can capture anything interesting, then I will show you. Otherwise, this is it. And this is maybe the end of the video. And uh, our next point will be Atomium. So I will cover that in a different part. I didn't find anything interesting on my way, but uh, just one uh, this swing, but this big one, like London Eye. So this is a square, it is on the height. It is away like 500 meter or something uh, from Manikinikis. And uh, from here you can see uh, the atomium I can see but I don't know if you can see on the camera or not so it is very far from here but you can see most of the Brussels from here from this height So guys this is it for today so i'm going to end my video here so meet you in the next below okay bye for time